Alright, here is Snip again. Yesterday, we've asked a question. Do you think it is required to disconnect the neutral or grounded conductor? And we have also discussed about the differences of it. Check out our last post about this. So let's check out the answers. Guy Laporte, his answer is no. While the genus of... Uh, I don't know. Diogenes said that the wiring in Florida, yes. Uh, I've asked him about this and he said that he's not sure. So probably uh, they use some kind of source there. I'm not really familiar with that. Um, Dave's GD125 is a neutral and ground conductor the same? Yes, we've answered that. They're not the same. And then Lloyd Dak, yes, he said no. And then MH Amnazar after service point, yes. But I've talked with MH Amnazar. He said no. He just clarified to me that he has some typo of the typing there. So let's check there. Okay. This one's from NEC 404.2B. 404.2B. It said that grounded conductors. Switches or circuit breakers shall not disconnect. Shall not disconnect the the grounded conductor of a circuit. So yeah, you're not required to do that. And then a switch or circuit breaker shall be permitted to disconnect a grounded circuit conductor where all circuit conductors are disconnected simultaneously. So yeah, it can if it's going to simultaneously. So simultaneous simultaneously so it's fine to disconnect it so that's the answer guys so i hope you'll learn something uh, just in case you need to check what is the difference between grounded conductor and a neutral conductor just try to check our previous posts about it most of the time they're the same but at some point they're not especially at corner grounded uh, uh, delta so check it out Thanks.